Oh, I didn't realise the... Uh, I thought the intro went on for a bit longer there, but anyway, never mind. Um, hello and welcome to uh, another game, but it's of the same trilogy, if you know what I mean. Uh, welcome, everybody. So, if you don't know the schedule, so yesterday it was GTA 3, today is Vice City, and tomorrow is going to be the... probably the most popular out of the three, right? Um, which is San Andreas. So, first of all, before I start, I need to make sure... <laughs> <laughs> that I don't get any copyright um, things. Although, you know, yesterday, um, I never got a copyright thing, and I think the music in, like on the radio was playing for like a few moments, so um, I think the music must have been non-copyrighted, luckily, or I got away with that one. So, anyway, let's turn it off. No, I don't want flash out. No, not wild style. Radio off. There we go. Okay, that's all I needed to do. So then, guys, I will start a new game, and we shall get into it. I haven't really played this before, apart from, like, a few minutes or, you know, for like half an hour to an hour um, when it first came out, which is about a day, like what, 24 hours ago or something. So anyway, let's begin. What do I need to do? I need to click game. And uh, yeah, as you can see, I have an auto save, but that was just me testing out, making sure it's all good. So um, let's go and start the new game. Uh, by the way, hey Lewis, hey Powerful Salts. Yes, I'm reading the comments now. Don't panic, I will read your comment soon, after this cutscene. Tommy Vecetti? Ha! <laughs> shit! Didn't they never let him out? He kept his head down, helps people forget. People will remember soon enough. When they see him walking down the streets of their neighborhoods, it will be bad for business. Well, what are we gonna do, Sonny? We treat him like an old friend and keep him busy out of town, okay? We've been talking about expanding down south, right? Vice City is 24 karat gold these days. The Colombians, the Mexicans, hell. Even those Cuban refugees are cutting themselves a piece of some nice action. But it's all drugs, Sonny. None of the families will touch Wait, is that... Times are changing. The families can't keep their backs turned while our enemies reap the rewards. So, we send someone down to do the dirty work for us and cut ourselves a nice, quiet slice, okay? Who's our contact down there? Ken Rosenberg, schmuck of a lawyer. How's he gonna hold Vicetti's leash? We don't need him to. We just set him loose and bite him, give him a little cash. Down, Wait, okay? hold on. Give it a few months, then we go down. Pay him a little visit, right? See how he's doing. Um, what's what on earth is that in the? Okay. Um. <laughs> oh dear. Right. Airport. Oh, it's just like GT Online, hey, guys, landing in. Uh, Ken Rosenberg here. Hey. Hey, great, hey. Well, uh, I'm gonna drive you guys to the meet, okay? Now, I've talked to the suppliers, and they are very, uh, keen This to looks quite good, actually. So, uh, if all goes well, we should, uh, be doing very nice to ourselves, which is, you know, good. Okay, so, they're brothers, okay? One <laughs> it looks nicer than GTA 3. <laughs> right, okay, I think that's the cutscene done. No! Somebody's flying in a helicopter. Okay, Is that a buzzard? That's them in the chopper. All right, here's the Probably deal. not. They want a straight exchange on open ground. All right? Okay, stay tight. Let's go. Oh, it's an exchange for money and sugar. Are they selling their MC businesses? Um, hey, Mark and John Gaming. Hey, Siep. Greg plays. Yep, Lewis Residence here, Psy Clan. Hello, guys. 100% pure grade A Colombian, my friend. Let me see it. The greens, 10s and 20s, used. Our Rebus gods wear the same thing, don't they? I think we have a deal, my friend. <laughs> oh, wait, that's, um... Those are the outfits from the s sneaky casino heist. Although not everything's the same as GT Online, of course. Maybe that's where they got, like, where they got the inspiration from. For any sudden sneaky assassin would wear something like that so they can't be seen. In my face. Go get some sleep. What are you gonna do? I'll drop by your office tomorrow and we can start sorting this mess out. Oh, they're still bumping into walls. <laughs> okay. Right, oh, big stretch, he does a nice stretch. I can't say hello and welcome, like, well, I can, but I can't do a wave. So I'll just, I'll punch, there we go, hello and welcome, everybody. 
Right, here we go. Um, this is the radar. Hello there. Got some people. Um, anyway, sorry, I'm getting distracted. I need to do the mission, right? I need to do what the game's telling me to do. So, yeah, this game was released, I think, a year or two after yesterday's stream game, which was GTA 3. So, yeah, they took all the good things about that last game and added it to this one. Uh, with a bunch of new features, a brand new location, a brand new storyline. Now wait, why is the radio on? I I turned that off. Oh, it's um, it's one of the um, it's like you know, like uh, what do you call it? A news broadcast, I think. You know, because I was hearing before, like when I was playing this, um, I was listening to the radio on this game, and then suddenly it said it was going to be like a a tornado or like some sort of hurricane. Wow, this looks really good. Like yesterday, you know, that game GTA 3 looked really good too. This is even better. It's a lot more colourful and vibrant. Hello, Sonny. Tommy! Tommy, it's been too long. I know, I know. You're just overwhelmed with emotion. Hey, I'm in gang. Seems like only yesterday. Welcome. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this. Time for the family is no piece of cake, but the family looks after its own. Okay? So how'd the deal go down? You sitting on some white gold? Look, Sonny, we were set up. The deal was an ambush. Harry and Lee are dead. You better be kidding me, Tommy. Tell me you still got the money. Oh yeah, this is no, set in like the I 80s, I think. So money. that's why their phones yeah, are just so money, <laughs> massive. My money. You better not be screwing me, Tommy, because you know I'm not a man to be screwed with. Wait, Sonny. You have my personal assurance that I'm going to get you your money back, and the drugs, and I'm going to mail you the dicks of those responsible. Hey, I already know that. You're not a fool, Tommy, but I warn you, neither am I. If it was anybody else, you'd be dead already. But because it's you, because we got history, I'm going to let you handle this. Look, Sonny, you got my word. I'll be in touch. I think that phone's broken. Right, so anyway, um, hey AddyQ as well, um, I don't know if the graphics mode is, I just have it standard, or like the way the game was, is there like different settings you can do? I haven't really seen or like, experimented with too much about that. Right, um, what was my car? He's, oh yeah, and also in this game you can see like, you know, you gotta make sure your health and stamina is uh, better than it were before. Right, let's go to the L to do the first mission in the game. And, you know, whenever, uh, like, the first time I saw this L, right, which is just now, I was thinking Lamar, or Lester, but no. It's someone else, probably. That would be a surprise, wouldn't it? Okay, we are here. We have arrived. Get some sleep, he says. <laughs> I have been sitting in this chair all night with the lights off, drinking coffee. This oh, this does look like a reviews office a little bit. <laughs> screwed me. These gorillas, listen to me, are gonna come down here and rip my head off. It's re ridiculous. I did not go to law school for this. Okay, now what? This this guy does act a little bit like a review. Shut up. Sit down. Relax. I'll tell you what we're gonna do. You're gonna find out who took our cocaine. And then I think he means sugar, guys. I think that's a typo. That's a good idea. That's a great idea. Let me think, let me think, let me think. Oh, there's this retired colonel. Colonel Juan... Oh, but he said it to his well. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's help me set up this deal well away from Vice City's established thugs, okay? Now listen, he's holding his party out in the bay on his expensive yacht and all of Vice City's big players are going to be there, okay? I have an invite. Of course I have an invite. But there's no way that I'm going out there sticking my head out the door. No I way, not I told you, happen. shut up. I'll go myself. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, I just I realized, too, the character speaks. <laughs> you know, this yesterday the character didn't say anything. Like the main character, the one that we control. <laughs> you might turn heads on the runway for the wrong reason. What's wrong with the way I'm dressed? Okay, look, here. Stop by Raphael's. 
Tell him I sent you. He'll make you look respectable. Okay, go. Come on. Uh, my favorite game on GTA... It's still GTA 5. <laughs> Like for sure, but this is really cool, like doing something different. And you know, this game released yesterday, of course. Uh, get some new threads. So, threads, you mean clothes, right? Is that what they say? They say, like, threads is clothes? Okay. Wow, look at this place. This is like. So colourful, you know? It looks a little, you know, like with the palm trees and that, you know, like, you know, Los Santos. A little bit, but that's tomorrow. Tomorrow we're going to have the full experience because, you know, San Andreas is basically Los Santos. But, yeah, just with a different name and, of course, the map is, is different, but it's based around, like, California. Uh, Los Angeles. Oh, whoops. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, I wonder, can we, like, run over trees, or is it just, like, a brick wall? Like in... GTA 5. Mm, nice bike. Wait, can I steal this? No, my bike! Um... Okay, I, I just thought there was loads of cops around. Okay, never mind. Um, but anyway, yeah, I was saying, like, there's so many cops around. How did they not see that was happening? Or did they think it was my bike? Like, he got off the bike, then I got on it. Oh, yeah, there were no bikes in GTA 3, were there? I just kind of realised that. Just now, when I'm... Driving a bike. <laughs> Wait, why? Every time he hits a lamppost, he just goes flying in the air. Right, let's get back on. The, the steering, guys, I'm not just a bad driver, like, well, I am a little bit, but, you know, like, I'm I'm turning, and this is how much it turns. <sighs> okay, well, so far, it's like, go to this point, go to that point. Drive here, drive there. Oh, gosh, I can hear some music. I hope this is not copyrighted. <laughs> Oh, well, it's in the background, so if they start talking, There's I should be fine. No there we go. You are here on the behalf of Mr. Rosenberg. I hope any recent problems have not affected his health or uh, mental well-being, Mr. Rossetti. He's just got a touch of uh, agoraphobia. <laughs> excellent, excellent. And you? I just want my merchandise. Ah, I have to say, guys, I think my yacht is better. For all involved. Of course, I have initiated my own lines of inquiry. Mine's got a roof. <laughs> this has no roof. Perhaps we'll talk later. Meanwhile, let me introduce you to my daughter. Mercedes! Mercedes? Could you look after our guest while I attend to my necessary obligations? Of course, Daddy. Please, excuse me. Hello, Mercedes. Mercedes. My name is... You try living with it. Benz. We can Benz. be Mercedes Benz. Let me Benz. point out some of our more distinguished guests. That's our congressman Alex Shrub with rising silicon star Candy Sachs. And have you met my lovely wife Laura? No? Well, uh, unfortunately, she's in Alabama. This is Candy. And over there, we have the <gasps> what? Vice City Mamba star title. It's Harry Potter. Always the charmer. And the guy from Red Dead Redemption. I put him in a wheelchair. <laughs> that is good. Well, now I'm looking at some prime. And that I did not expect to see him here. What was he doing here, actually? Love fest. <laughs> wow. <laughs> It does not involve a faddle, if you know what. Impotent. And the chatty trio, that sleeping sweat gland is Papa's right-hand gimp, Gonzalez. And the other two are Pastor Richards and Pseudo... Wow, well, what a crazy party this is. <laughs> ...with the Nipho invaders when the giant shark comes in and just bites their dicks off. And now, you never saw anything like that before. Colonel, your party's as ever a triumph. <laughs> I can only apologize. Well, the another day. amigo. How do we find you? <coughs> Our business is very dry. Barbarians at the gate. A time for rewarding one. And look at the height difference as well. <laughs> That's massive. Who's the loudmouth? Well, no, ma maybe it's just. Is it the camera angle? No, the one's really tall. The other's not so much. Oh, yeah, see, look. <laughs> back into town. Another time, Ricardo. 
Ricardo, let's go let's get out of Ricardo, like Daniel Ricardo? Take me to the proposition. Oh, never mind. Right. Um, take the colonel's daughter to the pole position. Wait, pole position? Like in F1, pole position? Is it a racing? Like place that we go to? Is there a racetrack? Maybe. It's so difficult having a rich and powerful father. Vamos. Oh yeah, by the way guys, um, just a quick review on this game so far. The handling controls are great. Like. Although I'm crashing all over the place, you know, it's very smooth. Oh yeah, look, checkered flags! It's my kind of, of place, this. Or name for a, for a place, anyway. A hundred dollars! A hundred... okay, I got a hundred... Wait, was that just from her to, like, deliver... Okay, never mind. Right, um... Yeah, this is really fun, uh, Mark and John Gaming. Um, hey, Sprinkles. Wait until I do the Phil Collins mission. How long is that? Like, how... What mission is that? Is that, like, mission... 5 or, like, 55? Because if I get... I don't think I'll do everything. Like, I'm just playing through, like, all of the trilogy games each day. Alright, we gotta go to an L, so we gotta go back and forth. Oh, why did I... Oh, I've got a one star. Is that a one star, like, one sheriff badge of a one to level? So weird seeing six stars, you know? Like, usually it's five. I'm just so used to five. <laughs> Right, okay, we have arrived back at the hotel. So we've gone from one place to the yachts, back to the hotel. Ah, well, I hope you're having a good time, because I'm going out of my mind with worry here. What did you find out? That there are more criminals in this town than in prison. We need a lead from the streets. Okay, let me think, let me think, let me think. Ah, I got it. Okay, there's this slimy, some music industry slime ball. Goes by the name of Kent Paul. Anyway, he's got his nose so far up most of Vice City's ass that if anybody knows the whereabouts of 20 keys of coke, it's this guy, all right? He's always at the Malibu. I'll go pay him a visit. Wait, we've got to pay? Got to pay to visit somebody? Oh, it's okay. It's just like a regular phrase. Right, okay, I knew that. I'm just joking, guys. Right, anyway, it's later on in the game, but you do a mission. Oh, where there's, like, a concert. Okay. Well, as long as it's not, like, in the first, like, ten missions or so. Because yesterday I played through about, what, 15... Yeah, 15, 20 missions yesterday. I don't think I'll do that many today. I don't know, because I think the number one game everybody... What? Ah, well, I hope you're having um, <laughs> wait, what just happened? <laughs> How? Um, right. Okay. Well, that didn't go according to plan. Oh, and the cops. Oh, this is not my car. I mean, it was just parked outside. Okay, never mind. I guess perhaps more expensive cars can blow up quite easily. Maybe that's the thing, like, the more powerful and the more speed you have in a vehicle, then... Yes! Oh! It happened again! And yeah, I've noticed too, look, look at all the cool cars in this game. You know, yesterday there weren't many really good cars, they all looked like the ones ahead. Like, in front of us. In the 50s, okay, that's good. So I'll probably pl play this... Like, I'll, what I've been doing, actually. So yesterday I had, um... I played through those few missions. I'm playing... I played a bit more, but I created, like, two different save files. So if I'm going back to this... Or if I want to stream it again... Then I can. 
you know, so I can play this, you know, off stream as well. Yeah, I'm the governor, Andy. I'll sort things out. You know what I mean? I'll treat you. Whatever you want, I'll get you, girl. Don't you worry about it, girl, mate. Get lost, honey. Oi, 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 oi. You Ken Paul? I'm a friend of Rosenberg's. Rosenberg? Rosenberg? Oh, that bonkers ambulance chaser. That guy could oh, be he's, uh, he's from the to death row. <laughs> my place. Tree, well, not, not my place. I mean... Listen to me. You know, he's got 20 keys not the exact ax fight. same accent it's as me. It's not American. He's British. Oi, oi, well, what I was coming to was, there's some chef come trumpet shifter who deals that kitchen of Hotel and Ocean Drive. He's been looking real pleased with himself lately. You could go and check him out. I will. And I'll be seeing you around. Yeah, that's right. Go and walk away, you mug. I knock you spark out. Give me a drink. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah, I know, Mark and John Gaming, you got to be so careful. As I slam into a lamppost. Right. Anyway, moving on. I hope today the game won't crash, of course. Uh, like it did yesterday. I didn't... Oh, I forgot to find out why it crashed as well. It just... I just did a mission and it... Yeah, it just crashed all in... Like, all on its own. Oh, whoops. Oh, it's a chef. Hey, what you looking at? Hello. You better start talking. Hey, make me, you prick. Press R2. Oh, we gotta fight him. Okay. <laughs> this is like the Simeon mission. But with a chef, not a car dealership guy. You can now receive phone calls. Oh, way to go, tough guy. Beat him to a pulp. That should make him real chatty. You want some too? Hey, kind of forgot why I had to kill him. What you want, brother? Oh, yeah? Look, my car's that floating. What? And my dead brother's wife. <laughs> Is that supposed to happen? Unfortunately, you just silenced our lead. Accidents happen. Get lost. Hey, hey, whoa. Well, no need to go. Look, it's a flying car. Hands. It's a deluxe, though. We two hombres in a strange Back to the future. We need to watch each other's back. My back's just fine, brother. You sure about that? Yeah, okay, I... Oh, what is this? <laughs> Do I have to kill them? Um... Okay, let's take this up the next level. Alright, I'm, I'm so sorry, guys. I don't know if I have to kill them, but you kind of... You're getting too close with your... Knives and whatever that is. I look, and the reason why I don't want to kill these guys is because, well, how else am I supposed to to eat some good food around here? You know. You have just picked up a bounty. No, a police bribe. This will reduce your water level by one star. And I had one star, so now I have zero, because that's how numbers work. I'm not playing GTA 5. Yeah, I'll, I'll be back playing GTA 5 probably on Sunday. That'll be in two days. One thing you realize oh, this this is raid. What? Turn off the radio. Oh, I don't think that was the radio. It was the guy talking in the, in the passenger seat. Right, so I've probably caused about a million dollars of damage so far. I've blown up so many of those Lamborghini type cars. From your laptop nor your iPhone? Yeah, that's fine, Resident. Are you guys looking forward to tomorrow the most, actually? Because that's San Andreas. San Andreas is tomorrow. Or are most of you guys wanting... GTA 5, come on, let me do my heist. Oh, you know what's funny, actually? Um, like, the next mission after the one that I finished yesterday's stream on, on GTA 3, that was, it was like a, a heist thing. But it wasn't, it wasn't like the heist on GTA 5, right? It was, it was actually quite different. Like, I just drove to a place, and, like, 
the gang of people just got in a building and got out. And that was it, really. If you have enough cash, you can buy your weapons. How much money do I have? I don't know. 50% off? Off what? Off everything, hopefully. That would be good. Um, hey, Jelly. Hey, Gecko. Hey, oh, Ninja's here as well. Welcome, guys. Hello. Right. Now, remember yesterday how long it took me to buy a weapon. Let's see how long it takes me today. Right, I have $100, so all I can really afford is this. Now I am bankrupt. I have no money whatsoever. But I think that would do, right? I just need a pistol uh, to start off with. Um, hey, Hype. Zeph, welcome to Not Los Santos. Yes, although it, I did say this before, but it looks a little bit similar to Los Santos. But tomorrow is going to look extraordinarily similar. You know, they've got Vespucci Beach in San Andreas. That was a good timing for um for that cutscene to happen, because I hit the the cop there. Two hundred? What? <laughs> this is terrible pay. Two hundred dollars? You know, yesterday I was getting like thousands of dollars right at the very start. Uh, hey, Georges. Transfer money from your GTA Online ba maze bank account. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, um, do you know what? It was really weird actually playing yesterday and not calling Lester to get rid of the cops. <laughs> You know, it, it was so weird and not being able to like use the phone and when it did happen It was just like a random message that took ages for like the screen to display the whole message Uh, yeah resident I do but I don't really use it too often Right, let's go to the L There we go. Oh, it's the hotel. Harrison Hotel. Is that Harrison Ford? Press R1 to answer your... Hey, uh, Leo, I think we got a buyer for Diaz Merchandise. Gotta give him a ring, man. It's a brick. It's a Nokia brick. That's how it survived all those explosions. <laughs> oh, dear. Put Leo on, man. Leo's gone away for a while. He left me in charge. Screw you, man. Right, let's go. Oh, back in, okay. Um, what are you playing on? This is PS5. Uh, Macho, hello, and oh, welcome sake, oh, to Vice City. I'm gonna need new pants. Hey, those psychos yeah, I, I've never played this game before, so... Down here soon. Now, where is the I've money? got no idea what's relax, happening. Relax. We're not at that point oh, yet. I thought that you were taking care of this. I really did. And now those guidos say we gotta do them a favor. You mean I gotta do them a favor? Oh, of course that's what I mean. Do I look like I can intimidate a jury? Is this like El Rebe's father? I'm intimidated child, and believe me, I've tried. Now look, it's either that or Ferelli's cousin Giorgio gets five years for fraud. You gotta take these guys out. I understand. Help the jury change their minds. Don't worry about no, it. No, 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 no! I tried that. The jury case didn't go so well. So make them change their minds. Okay, how do I do that then? <laughs> I think there's a Lester mission in the game. What's... wait, is there really sprinkles? Oh! <laughs> what? <laughs> wait, was that supposed to happen? <laughs> that was, that was, oh, that was too funny, right. Um, I guess I'll steal his car. <laughs> See, even that guy in the suit's confused. He's like, what on earth just happened there? Right. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Where am I supposed to go? Oh yeah, should we have a look at the map? I haven't showed you guys the map yet, so... Check this out, we got a beach. And yeah, this is the whole place, really. Um, and if you guys are wondering, or if you're saying like, oh, is that it, really? This was, like, 2003 or 4 this was released, so... 
yeah, the Rockstar were limited with the space, you know, this was released like on PS2, right, so... Or the original Xbox, I think. This game is great. 2002! Okay, I was close, I was close. Did you have to, like, look that up, Jelly, or did you know? Automatically. Oh! What is it with all these collisions? You can smash cars by using the hammer or a similar weapon. Um, I don't have my hammer. I don't know where that went. Smash up the Juris car. Wait, I... Hold on. I know this mission. This is, you know, the nightclub popularity missions where you got to, like, smash up the developer's cars. It's like that. And there's also a mission, a contact mission on GTA where you have to, um... You have to, like, um, kill the jurors. Yo, man, I still got payments. Oh, whoops. <laughs> so I didn't mean to kill her. I was aiming for the car. No, he's not guilty. Oh, no, he's running away. Whatever will we do? Do you have to kill him? Replace your machete with a hammer. How... What button I... I think I've left my hammer behind. Don't think it matters too much. Or at least I hope it doesn't. Yeah, because there's, look, look, there's a yellow checkpoint, so I'll go there next, see what I have to do. Have you played this before then, though, Jelly? Because I only play GTA 3. So, yes, tomorrow will actually be my first time playing San Andreas properly. Oh, one type of... Oh, okay. So, Rockstar, they added the weapon wheel to these games. But it doesn't work quite the same as, as GTA V. So you can only have one thing per slot, okay. Yeah, that's understandable. That makes it more of a challenge, I suppose. Where is he? Oh, he's, oh, he's hiding over there. Okay. Hiding from the rain. Smash up the Juris car. Oh, we have to do it again? Well, the... Uh, <laughs> the Butcher's Knife or whatever this is, it works. Quite similar, anyway. Why is that not smashing up? Oh, does it not work on this car? Right, I'll just keep doing this and hopefully something happens. Uh, you should use cheat codes on San Andreas, there are tons of them. I should have done that yesterday actually as well, because, and, well, we could do it today too. Yeah, I think I need that hammer, don't I? Where, where is the hammer? I don't <laughs> Have I lost my hammer? Oh! Right, hold on. Right. Um, oh, I can't get into that car because I need to blow it up. Right, I'll go and get this hammer. You prefer GTA 4? Not GTA 5? Is that not... I thought everybody's favourite was... Yeah, well, San Andreas, of course, but... GTA 5 is, like, the most popular... MC Hammer, <laughs> yeah, or um, or M MC Businesses. Oh dear, oh dear. Right, so let's uh, get this hammer. Whoops. So I think once um, I've played... Am I going the... 
don't know if I'm going the right way here. Um, but yeah, no, it's after San Andreas, so that would be... I played pretty much all of the games. All of the GTA games, apart from, like, a few... Where is it? What? Right, I'm gonna go on foot and see if I can find this. There, there's a hammer here, but I can't get to it. I need to, I need to run to it, I think. Go inside the mall. Yep, still you have to spam um, X to, to run and stuff. Whoa, look at all the stuff. They've got, like, restaurants, fast food places. Right, where's the hammer? Is that a hammer? No, that's a chainsaw. Right, hello, yes, I would love a hammer. Buying this weapon will replace the current weapon. Okay. Yes, okay, I've got it. I've got my hammer. Alright, let's get out of here. This looks so cool, like, you know, in GTA 5, like, all of the shopping mall places are just, you know, you can't really do much. Because all of the shops are kind of spread out, like the gun store, etc, etc. Um, hey, King of Killing, hey, as well, welcome to, um, the stream, to Sailor Moon 2, welcome back. Uh, that's good, Sailor Moon. And yes, this is not GTA 3, Vice Cities today. San Andreas tomorrow. Right, let's go back and smash up these cars. I should be an expert at this mission, the amount of times I've smashed up cars. But I can't get into the car that I want to smash up anyway. It wouldn't let me, it was locked. Uh, what should you play? You have PS4, Xbox 360, and a PS2. Uh, you could play this. Like, I know you don't have the trilogy, right? But it's the same game anyway, just with a better coat of paint on the Definitive Edition, so... Like, you you could play the same missions as I'm playing on stream if you want or something. Oh, yes, there we go. Look at the look at that damage. That is a lot of damage. And no, we're not sponsored by Flex Tape. Giorgio sends his regards. Do so you think it was even it even existed back in back in this time? Four hundred dollars. Okay, grinding to a billion dollars on this game will take a very long time. I've just realised. $100 here, $200 there, 400 double the amount from the last mission, wow! Right, let's go! Oh, that's genius, I sh yes! Addy Q, why did I not think of that? I could have just rammed my car with the other car that I wanted to damage. Oh well. Well, at least I've got my hammer anyway, so... I guess that will come in handy soon. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, that that does look like a stun jump, doesn't it? Shall I do it and see... See if I can do this stun jump? I'll take, I'll take a massive run-up. Because you know in GTA 3, you get paid for doing stun jumps. Alright, here we go. Whoa! Oh, it, it does like a slow motion thing. Uh-oh. Yeah, see? Okay, so even on this game too, you get paid for doing stun jumps. And that's going to catch on fire, so I need to get out. Oh, who's this? Hello? Hey, Donnie, it's Sonny. I'm <laughs> the suntan. I ain't got no suntan. Well, you ain't got my money either, so I'm one of them myself. 
What are you doing? So tell me, tell me, what are you doing? Oh, cops, cops, cops. For the money, Sonny. I'll go this way. I am worried, Tommy. That's my style because I didn't have a well, that's a cool car. With unreliable people. Don't be an unreliable person, Tommy, please. Do us both. I can't get in. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Right. Off we go. See, so on this game, you can't, you can't like call people and drive at the same time. How very sensible of, of Rockstar. <laughs> um, do taxi missions. You can do taxi missions in this game too. How are they like? Is it like Crazy Taxi or something? <laughs> you know, do you guys know that game? I have that actually on PS2 as well. Oh, whoops. Let me just get inside before they start shooting those cops. Any progress? No, 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 no. Tell me later. Tell me later. Tommy, this is Avery Carrington. I believe you met at the party. Not in person. Is that Dutch? Avery here has a No, it can't be Dutch. Haven't we got other things on our mind? The Red of Redemption 2 guy. So could you please cut me some slack? I'm stretched like a wire, and even if I'm dead by the end of the week, I'd like to think that I didn't die poor. Now just okay? calm down, both of you. Son, you help me, and any grease balls giving you a hard time, I'll see to it. To <laughs> he even sounds time. like him a little bit. Okay, what could I do for you? This delivery company's got its depot on some prime land. They won't sell. They're hanging on like a big old prairie rat. So we gotta go in there and smoke that vermin out. Head on down there and stir up a hornet's nest. Security will have their hands full, and then you can sneak in and put them out of business. And you could drop um, bills for a change of clothes. You might be there a while, but yeah, Duggan, okay. like Duggan Shipments. The balls drop like they should. Stop by my office sometime. It is weird playing these games. You see, like all of the features from like all the newer GTA games, like Group Six vans and ammunition, all of that stuff. You're like, oh, that's where they got it from. Oh, they, you know, ammunition was a thing way back in the day, too. You haven't played the Casino Penthouse missions? Oh! Um, right. Um, okay, that's logged off. <laughs> Wait, did the cop just run over Oh, I ran over them, too, but he just ran over someone. No, Jenny, I have done the casino missions, but it was a long time ago. On GTA 5 Online, right? Unless there's there's a, like a casino thing on, on this game. Whoa, it's... um. Looks, I look a little bit like Mario, but just not, you know. Right, never mind. Let's go. Save the princess. Oh, that's a tight. Sorry, sorry. Whoops. I also just want to go on a rampage and see what happens, you know. I'll do that scene though. I'll leave. I'll leave the excitement. For a bit later, although we could see a bit of excitement here, of course, because we are doing these missions. I've got no idea what's going to happen next. You just remembered there's a really frustrating mission coming up. Do you know what, what it's called? So when it happens, I can get ready. <laughs> um, hey Mads, how much does it cost? So for me, it was around 50 something pounds. And that's for all three games. 55 pounds. Start fighting with... Um... <laughs> I... Right... Okay, who's who's the weakest out of them? I feel like it, it might be this guy. Now, usually it's the people at the back, right? Let me try and... Get the one closest to the exit so I can just run away if this doesn't go well. So I'm supposed to punch these people. <laughs> what for? 
Are they all gonna start chasing me or something? Oh, look at that! I'm so not used to, like, the kicking animation. That's so funny. Oh, now they're fighting each other. Destroy the vans in the compound. What an <laughs> Oh, this is so funny. You'll never see this in GTA 5, because GTA 5 is a lot more realistic. Cool. Something, right, let's smash up these vans. <laughs> you might as well just get your PS2 out again. Do you know, Mads, the controls comparing them to PS2 to this, they've improved them massively. Like, they've, they've put in, you know, like, the GTA 5 controls? They've added them or tried to, like, add them to this game. So, for example, look, there's a weapon wheel on this game. And I don't think that was a thing, was it? Like, in the original games. And of course, the main the main difference being the graphics as well. Being a lot better. Oh, that right. Thank you. Hype. Thank you so much. You're very helpful. <laughs> I I thought this was gonna take forever to do. No, just hit hit the uh, the cans, the petrol tanks. Or the jerry cans. Just like your repossession, you know? Uh, coveralls outfit delivered to Tord up in the North Point Mall. Okay. But I think we will go to A, because there's a A mission thing. Logo that we need to go to. Hello? Uh, is this Mr. Versetti? Yeah. Uh, this is Cortez. You Cortez? Yeah, Who's that? Uh, Mr. Versetti, it was a most unfortunate incident that happened when you killed the deal. I know. I want you to know me and my people are doing their utmost to get to the bottom of it. If you'd like to talk Am I supposed to go in? I don't know. <laughs> okay. Good day, senor. New contact point, okay, um, at the marina in the ocean beach. Oh, it's a limousine! Come in and park yourself on the hide, son. Hell, my daddy used to say, never look a gift horse in the mouth. And by golly, he never did. Would you like a drop of the old Kentucky? No, thanks. A clean thinker. I like that. Now, the property business Kentucky is... Kentucky like KFC. It's about dirt. And the will to claim that dirt. You with me, son? Oh, it's a drink. Oh, yeah. Well, I need some tenacious bastard to let go of some dirt. And you look to me like the kind of guy to persuade him. Persuasion's my forte. Yeah, he'll be down at the country club, down on the golf course. Golf? Gun, so his There's golf? Will be back in law givens. Go beat eight oh, we, we gotta check this out. Is there actually golf in this membership. game? And boy, you're gonna need more appropriate clothing. This guy's my new friend. I never had a friend with a Wii before. Uh, you never played this game. Your first GTA was San Andreas. So, I... I've only really played the very first GTA. The one where it, like, it looks like this, you know, you got a, a top-down view. And it was all in 2D, and GTA 3. And a bit of GTA 4. And of course GTA 5. So I've never played this or San Andreas. Bastard. Right, so let's get some clothes at the clothes store. Oh, it does it automatically, okay. What on earth is going on? I can hear like a bunch of crashes just in the background. <laughs> We're ready to play some golf. Oh, uh, well, Addy Q, I'm not that old. I'm just, I just had a, a PS2 and, you know, and a PS1 as well. But you know how you can play PS1 games on PS2.
So th this wasn't like 25 years ago that I first played it. It was it was more like 10 or 5. You know, I, I just probably one day just decided to play like some more games just to see how they were. Some weapons have been removed. Oh, okay. Whoa, look at this. It's golf. I'll get a golf cart and tennis as well. Can you actually play golf or is it just there to look nice? Oh, imagine if there was an online of this, you know, we could all play golf. Who is this guy? Boys, oh! Get him. To that site. Wait, what? I've been violated! I'm so oh, I'm supposed to kill him. Okay. <laughs> right, now I know what to do. Where's he gone? Oh, he's getting away. Get him! No! Right, let me deal with his agents. There we go. <laughs> oh, this is just pure chaos. Which was mine? Oh, it doesn't matter which one I get into. Okay, what? I don't even know what's going on here. When you move around quickly, it's laggy. I'll try not to move too fast. Is it all is it all okay now? Uh hey Lem Gems. Um well I'm from England. This car is extremely valuable, idiot. It's not really laggy at all, okay. Wait, how am I supposed to get him? Do I just ram him? I have no weapons. Apart from a hammer, of course. Why did the security not get rid of my hammer? Like, I guess they might have thought I was like there to repair, like some buildings or something. I don't know. I'm a construction worker. Father, he hit me. If I wait, could I try and get him in? I'll try and ram in, like ram him into the ocean. See if that does anything. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Look at his face as well! This guy here. Oh, that's so funny. See, I need to kind of like um, get him to topple over. Just like this, actually. Wait, what? Mission failed? Oh, great. Okay. Well, now I know what the guy is I need to kill, so I'll have to just target him first. Come right, let's skip all of this again. Blah, blah, blah. On our way to the golf course. Sorry about this, guys. Um, do you think this should be priced for sixty dollars, sixty pounds? Um, uh, well, I guess, I guess everybody wants this to be less. And from what they've done, it's not um, a remake, is it? It's a remaster, so it's basically the same game. But you know, if that if that money goes towards making GTA Six even better, then they can take my money. Just <laughs> take your time, Rockstar. Me. Nice ass, baby. Right, time for some golf. Is it too much? Yeah, it's a little bit too much. I feel like 20 to 30 pounds would have been good for this. Because the original, they had these games already, like in the PlayStation Store and stuff. But it wasn't this, it wasn't the definitive edition, it was... Ah, uh, something else. 
it was just the same game as before, but... Yeah, I, I don't know. It, it depends, really. If you haven't played these games before, then it's definitely worth um, buying this for sure. Yeah, PS2 Classics. I'm gonna block the uh, entrance. Who is this guy? Boys, deal with him. Get him! To that psycho! No, 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 oh, he's... Really? I, I don't understand, like, back in the day, how on earth, like, without the internet and stuff, how would you find out how to do these missions? There's no way I can get him. It might be 30 FPS than 60. Wait, <laughs> there's an ambulance? Hey, boy scout. What on earth? Wait, do they, do they, um... Are they going to, like... Whoa! So, on this game too, you can bring people back to life. Or the ambulance paramedics just bring people back to life. Yeah, hi, do you know how to do this? I'm just chasing this guy around. With a hammer. It's kind of impossible to chase. When all you have is, like, as a weapon is a hammer. Is this the very difficult mission somebody was talking about? They were like, oh, in a few missions time, it's like, there's such a really difficult mission you need to do. Oh, there he is. Uh, listen to Flash FM radio station. Uh, why is that? Is like all the music there non copyrighted? Oh man, I almost feel sorry for you. Get him! Oh. What? Oh my gosh. Where's he going? There he is! Right, let's chase him! Oh no, what? Right. He got away, Oh, Okay, so now I know there's two points I can try and get him. Like, at the very beginning of that mission where you have to... Where he starts to run away. And also, when he gets out of his car. I just need to have a better... Better aim and stuff. Come in and park yourself on the hide, son. Hell, my daddy used to say never It's got some epic 80s music, but is that copyrighted? Or is it not copyrighted? Because I, I would love to sing along to all these songs, but yeah. Like, you know on GTA 3, um, there was... There's um, a classical radio station channel, of like opera and stuff. Is the audio muted? Um, the radio, I've turned the radio off. Wait, you, you guys can hear like all the other music, right, in the game? I've only turned off the radio. See, look, it says radio off. Yeah, that's it. Double clef. That's the radio station. That's what Rockstar should do for the new GTA 5 online DLC. Have a classical radio station channel. It's a bit of a joke as well, you know. <laughs> Oh, that'd be so funny. F 
Flash FM is gone. Who is this guy? Boys, deal with him. Get him! To that psycho! Oh, stop! No! I hit him a few times. I got a few hits on him. Right, let me let me just kill these guys first. I know I've got a bit of time. Right. Press R1 to pick up a weapon. R1. Ah! I now have a golf club. I wonder, is that better to use? Is that what we needed to do then so I didn't use my hammer? Oh, the hammer was a bit useless here. Oh! Yes! 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 I got him! Yes! Oh, that is perfect. Do you know, I, I said, what if I were to whack him in the water? Wow, that actually worked. <laughs> that's perfect. <laughs> oh, right, that took so long to do, but I've, I've finally done it. So off we go to the next mission. Oh, so that's... You know, I was yesterday I was wondering why they're like all these silhouettes of people. So whenever someone dies, they just leave this silhouette of them on the ground. Um, hey Universal. Have you got this game too? Oh, I can get some health as well. Oh, I need to get out, don't I? To, uh... Right, there we go. Have I got my weapons? Oh, yes! Right, so where do we go next? Um, to the sea, to the sea or to the sea, I think that's what we, oh no, there's an A. Right, let's go to the A. Can you fly planes on this game? I know, I don't think you can swim. Yeah, there was a thing, I, I said this yesterday too, but yeah, I don't think you can swim. Uh, hey NBA, it's a money crab this game. Well, um, I just said this before NBA, like someone was saying like, what do you think about the price and that? Like, if Rockstar used the money wisely. Although, do they, they don't really need the money, do they? They have so much of it, but to make GTA 6 even better, you know, then do whatever they want, really. And, you know, they've made a good game. I've never played this before. So, for those who've already played this, I understand, like, there's no point really buying this again. Unless you want to play this again, in, a, in like, better quality. And with improved controls. Now look here, son. Um, hey, Palvasaur again. It's problem. starting. What is starting? I'm no builder. No, I was thinking more of your demolition skills. Now, this here, this is the development as planned, and this, this is the property that we're looking at. You're trying to say this new office block is kind of in the way. You catch on quick. Now I'm gonna head out of town for a while, and if that office development would have faced sudden and insurmountable structural problems, then I... As a civil-minded individual, you feel obliged to step in and save the rejuvenation of an important area of the city. Where can I get more guys like you? 
San Andreas was a massive upgrade compared to this. The map, because yeah, I played San Andreas when it came out on this edition, like for a, like half an hour or so, and just, I was just like exploring the whole city and everything, and just driving around, not doing the missions. Yeah, it's a lot bigger. It's like, I think triple or quadruple the size of this place. What happened to your dislike button? Did I disable it? No, YouTube have disabled um, the dislike display thing. If you look at other videos and every other video on, on this, like on YouTube, it's not there. It just says dislike. So that's not me. <laughs> that's that happened to everybody. To pick up a- oh, we gotta- okay, we're gonna use a bomb. Press circle. But yeah, powerful, what's starting? F1? I don't think that starts until uh, 7, doesn't it? There is what- no, yeah, je Jelly, yeah, there is, but it doesn't tell you, like, tell you the number. It still works, but you can't see the display, like, it doesn't... Oh! Oh, we can fly. Yeah, it doesn't tell you, like, the number of dislikes. Oh, it shows you? Okay, it doesn't show me, though. How does it show for Jelly and not? You have to update YouTube? No, I think it's for everybody. Right? Or not? I don't know. I was literally saying before. You know, like, um, oh, can you fly in this game? And immediately the next mission is flying. Is there a... No, there's no time limit. Oh, there is! Right, there is a time limit. Oh, yeah, and also, look, I know there is... Yeah, it says time left, right? But remember yesterday, I was like, oh, look at the time. The time... Because I thought there was a, like a countdown, but then I realised the time was going up on the very top right. That is the time of day, so it's like 7.37pm. I I thought that was like the game time, the, mis the game mission time. And I didn't, I think I started to realise, um, like, uh, like when I was playing the game after the stream of GTA 3. And I was like, wait, what? what's going on here? Like, it, it went from 23 minutes to zero minutes, like the time of reset during a mission. Oh, it's the time of day. Oh, right. And then it started to click. You're literally entering every giveaway for this game. You know, I want to see, um, oh, there's the, how am I supposed to get up there? Um, yeah, I'd love to see the comparison videos, you know. I think I was going to say I was going to check them out, but I never did. I've only seen the trailer that was released, oh, it must have been a, a long time ago now. Like, well, not a long time ago, like two or three weeks ago, Rockstar put out, like, the very first trailer. Of this game. How am I supposed... Are they on the top floor? It won't go any higher than this. <laughs> this is a weird mission. Um, this is a digital copy um, ninja. Because you could play the, uh, the digital quite early on PlayStation. I can't get in. 
Oh, I know what's off. Oh, of course, using the stairs to... Ah. Oh. I saw some stairs. Yeah, see? Right. There we go. Are these guys going to do nothing? Like there's a helicopter inside their construction place. Oh yeah. Yeah, they're going to do something. But they can't do anything. They're... I'm above them. I can just fly away. Bob the Builder. It's chasing after me. Should we play San Andreas afterwards? Uh, yeah, but there's... We can't play, like, online, right? Wait, is there a... No, there's not an online of... That only came with GTA 4, didn't it? Or not, I don't know. I can't remember, I didn't I didn't have San Andreas back in the day, so I, I don't know. Up, down, left, right. Uh, have I played Vanguard? No, I haven't. Um, I don't think I will. Maybe in a few years when it's free on the PS Store. You know, because um, Black Ops 3 is, is free. Oh dear. Damn, I gotta lay off the pills. I'm seeing shit. Oh, there's a cop as well. Right, I've gotta be ready fast here. You want me to drill you? Two minutes left to go down and then back up and go all the way up um, to the final checkpoint. There's one more target left. What's the worst? Being blown up or having to, you know, get killed with these blades? What's the... Uh, what is the worst thing to happen? Actually, you know, the worst thing to happen would be for this mission to... to fail because I haven't done... got all the bombs in time. Oh, this, this thing is quite slow too. 1 minute 22 seconds. Right, I need to, I need to concentrate. It's like a G GTA Vice City speedrun right here. I think I should make it, but do, do I need to uh, exit or... Like, exit the building? Oh, that, that guy's um, head was in the wall. Yes! Oh, okay. About 30 seconds to spare there. Wow, look at that explosion. One thousand dollars! Still terrible pay, but I'll take it, I, I suppose. Wait, is the money low on this game because it was set in the 80s or something? I kind of forgot about inflation. Right, let's remove this waypoint. Where's the next one? We go to the sea. I think that's the next place to go. There it is. We've got this van, top fun. If it was a speedrun, I'd be done already. How many missions actually? I don't know how many missions are on this game. Well, there must be at least 50 something, because Sprinkles, you said like the copyrighted music thing was 
around Mission 50-something. But no, yeah, I mean, no, but the thing is, Sprinkles, that would be a professional Vice City speedrunner. For me, you have to add inflation to that, so that would be... Yeah, i take about triple or quadruple the time a normal speedrunner would probably speedrun this game. This would be cool to speedrun. But I think I need to, uh, to do another GTA 5 story mode speedrun first. Or we could do an online speedrun. I wonder if there's any categories for like completing all of the online heists in GTA 5 Online. See if that's the speedrun category. It probably is. I guess you just need a team of people as well to help you. Oh wait, that was that was a route to my checkpoint. Not not to the actual next mission. A slow run. <laughs> yeah, this is more like a casual walkthrough, isn't it? Right, hello. Pierre T. Like Pierre Gasly. Okay, never mind. Mr. Versetti, Colonel, thank you for coming. Please sit. Lobster. No, thanks. Uh, I am ashamed to admit... It's like three million. Problem. ...appears to have been the loose tongue of a man I used to trust. I've been carrying Gonzalez for years. But now, his incompetence reaches new heights. It's only right that you kill Gonzalez. Did he do it? It's the money that's important to me. For this kindness, I'll reward you. And then, we will find your money together. He will be at his penthouse, half drunk probably. We're gonna chop down some trees. Go and kill Co Wait, what? We'll get through this one, baby. I... I'm so sorry. Deep down, they know I'm man. Oh! <gasps> Wait, was that the... Is that the wrong person? Oh, it is. I can see there's a purple. I just killed someone for no reason. A slow walks. Oh, very, very clever. Very clever. That's a good one. Slow walks. That should be a category. Trying to play a game in the slowest time. Two wheels. Oh, it's going to blow up. Or not. Oh, no. Right, never mind. Mr. Versetti. Yeah, I know them gems. But wait, you sent that message before I did that, so before I got wasted there. Best driver in GCA. It's not me. Do you know I I have to say though, like when I was playing GTA 3 off stream, after yesterday's stream, I was not crashing. You know, I was driving so well. Then when the stream starts... When you got comments as a distraction... Uh, then it all kicks off. So I beat three already? No, 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 I haven't. I've, um... I'm, I'm at, like, mission 23. Out of 77, or, yeah, 23, 24, something. In Chaos Mod. Whoops. See guys, look, most of the time there's hardly anywhere to pass. There are just cars everywhere, just... See, look, like here, you're either going to have to go this way and... Run people over or just smash into 
smash into cars or just have to stick to the speed limit and just wait behind them. Uh, what games do I have on PS on PS5 and PS4? I had it for you. One, two. Better shut that big mouth of yours. Uh, he's got a blade. I have a lot. Stop running, you fat slime ball. Mm. Away from me, you cheap bastard. Oh, I've got to kill this guy. Oh, sweet Jesus. I've wasted my life and my look. Stand still oh, okay. Wow, what is this? Right, let's get him. You know, I thought he was going to steal my van for a second. Oh, wait, let's wait until the cops go by. Before I, before I do it. Oh! Oh, my. Oh, no, the cops! Right, forget the van, just... Right. Sorry. Right, yep. I've got a chainsaw. Right, let's go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, that would be me. If I saw that, I'd be that guy just running into... Well, he ran into a lamppost there, but he ran as far away from the... From the scene as possible. But yeah, Lamb Gems, I mean, if you know my PSN profile, you can have a look and see what games I have. Yeah, they're all there. I think you can even see some more PS3 games. Oh, get into a... Cost $100 to... Oh, to respray it! Oh, okay. There we go, that's better. 250 dollars, so I got two, 250 million dollars, wow! Or is it 250,000? Trying to put the prices up. Inflation wise. Wow, they... They're so smart, these, these cops. But, um, the problem is their stinger was a little bit too short, so I was just able to... Look, I can just do this and just go around there. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't think that one through, but I guess they don't want to like injure pedestrians by putting spikes on a on a pathway on the path. Or if you're American, of course, a sidewalk because you need to know where you're walking on the side. Hello Kitty, dress up <laughs> sprinkles. You could have said, um, Frozen Snowball Fight. Because I have played that game. It's, it's like, the game is Tetris. That's basically what it is, but it's... Just got, like, the Frozen characters. On the screen and stuff. You can have a look! I have played it. I don't know if it's there. I think it must be, because I got a trophy, I think. Uh, from playing that game for some reason. I think it was because I was like, wow, if I can just buy these or get these and download these free games, these easy, cheap free games, I can get so many Platinums on them. But then you realise most of the Platinums aren't that easy to get, no matter what the game is. Am I going to speedrun my friend Peppa Pig? Um... Do you guys want me to? Should I actually do that? Because I, I saw this, that the, um, like a trailer for the game. I don't know why it was recommended to me, but anyway. Oh no, I don't, I think I actually searched it on myself. Because I, I saw it from somewhere else. So yeah, then it must have been recommended for me then. Perfect parking. <laughs> oh, and I've got my chainsaw still. A mall shootout. We're gonna have a shootout at the mall. 
Tommy, come and join me. This looks delicious, eh? Huh? What on earth is that? Tommy, you are like a pompous breeze that has freed me from the stench of corruption. Although I must appear to mourn his passing and carry on with business as usual. This isn't getting me any closer to my money. Tommy, my friend, you are not in liberty now. Here, we do things differently. I will continue with my inquiries, but in the meantime, I have a valuable deal to close. A favor for a friend, Cortez? You're a good friend, Tommy. I knew you would not let me down. I need you to meet a courier who has obtained some valuable technology for me. Right. I still got my chainsaw. Wait, okay, wait, hold on. So you're telling me it just takes one... One slice and someone's... On the ground with loads of ketchup on them. But if I try and chop down the tree, no, 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 that's impossible. You can't do that. How was the flying mission? Y you know what, Hype? It was very simple and easy. Once I knew what to do. Of course it told me to plant, or like, place bombs. In a building... Construction site. But it was all blocked off. Then I realised, oh yeah, you can go up the stairs. I had like 30 seconds to go when the whole thing blew up, so... Like, before the timer ran out, which was good. Oh, I'm supposed to go to the gun store first. Right. A GT Online needs a chainsaw. Oh yeah, for sure. We have a hammer, we have most of the weapons on this game. Maybe for the DLC coming up, you know, that could be something. Rockstar can do. Oh, <laughs> I've got to be on arms so I can buy stuff. Right, I've got a lot of money, so I could really afford the... Kruger? Kruger? Isn't that a... No, that's a vehicle, isn't it, on GT5 Online? I don't know. Right, I'll just take this one then. And let's get the body armor too. Let's buy some of that. Oh, you can't buy multiple bits of body armor. You're playing Vice City. Oh, th there's a bear too. Bear left or bear right. Did you get it? Because that nav's... Okay. All right, never mind. Let's go. It was probably because of the refined controls. The controls used to be really, really bad. So that mission was considered one of the most frustrating ones. Oh, so yeah, that was the mission that you were saying that was really difficult. That might be coming up soon. When I was about 10 minutes into this stream or something. Yeah, they really improved the controls. I don't know because I haven't played the original, but... it Yeah, it was quite easy to play once I knew what to do. Oh, he's on the top floor. Oh, escalators! Another thing that's not in GTA 5 online, is it? Or GTA 5? There's no escalators. Oh! Bonjour, bonjour. Ha -ha. It is... It's got a moustache and everything. <laughs> This is like a stereotype. Oh! Where's he gone? Uh, 
I uh, give it back to the colonel. All right, let's go. Sorry about that, Mr. French person, but uh, that's what the mission told me to do was to try and get your briefcase and off we go. Uh, hey Sean, welcome back, this is not GTA 3, this is Vice City today. And the one that everybody's been looking forward to, San Andreas, will be tomorrow. So I'll be playing, I, I would have played through all three games by tomorrow, on stream, well not through like all of the missions of course. You're playing the original. Tomas, I appreciate your coming. Forgive me for getting straight to business. Beers How does it compare to this? Let's hope it goes better than last time. Which is why I thought of you, my friend. I've dropped some protection at the multi-story car park. Pick it up, then go and watch over Diaz's man at the drop-off. Gracias, amigo. Diaz, huh? Apparently that angry midget runs this madhouse. Let's see what that creep has to do with things. The Colonel has arranged some firepower. Right. Oh yeah, also there, there's no um, mile count. It doesn't tell you like how far there is to go. Uh, for these missions. And I was saying yesterday why that isn't a feature on, on GTA 3, because the map is so small anyway. Distance isn't really a, a main issue, is it really? <laughs> other than just shadowing me everywhere why don't you come along and show me if you're any use i might just do that the name's lance by the way tommy versetti let's go go with lance to drop off the weapons all oh, right okay i thought it was going to be like you know the very first uh, uh lester assassination uh, mission where you need to like go to a, a car park thing and wait until this guy gets out of the hotel Actually, how many... I want to see how many missions there are in this game, actually. Um, I'm sure there's a button. Mission attempts, 9. Rampage. Percentage completed, 6%. Does it tell you how many missions there are? Okay, I, I don't know. Never mind. Right. Let's go. Oh, 87, okay. I don't know what mission number this is. Oh, you searched it up, okay. <laughs> it doesn't tell you. Oh, d do we need to get in a car to... Really? Really? Ah, oh, okay, okay. That just looks really silly. If you don't know, you should have, uh, 
Use the car to use the checkpoint. We both better get a good vantage point. Okay, I'll take the balcony. You get the roof across the yard. Wait, what am I supposed to do? Oh, you use the balcony. Alright, go up the stairs. Oh, no, okay, I see. Other side. Got it. Oh, no, I just jumped down. <laughs> I jumped down on the cutscene. Right, stay... Stay there, I've got my Kruger ready. Uh, hey Sean. Right, it's not working, use a different weapon. Shooting on this game is a lot better. Like the auto aim is, is better than GTA 3. Um, but yeah, hey Sean. Um, so tomorrow is San Andreas. So that should be fun because that's like everybody's favourite out of the three. And so Sunday, so the day afterwards, I'll be back on GTA 5. Most likely. gonna say how can someone survive all of that chase him down <laughs> you know what playing playing through this the very first time I sort of understand the story but there are some bits I'm like, well, hang on, what is going on here exactly? I was the same with GTA 5 a little bit as well, actually. That was a little bit easier to understand than... ...other games for the story. Eighty-seven thousand, no, eight eight thousand seven hundred missions. Lester said, "Stay in Vice City." That he doesn't want to see me back in Los Santos. <laughs> oh, does he not? Well, I I kind of told Lester I'll be, you know, in Liberty City and Vice City and stuff, but I'll be back. I'll be back soon. You know, Lester, he tempted me, saying, "You know, he'll put double money on the uh, Act Three heist for the Doomsday heist." Uh, but yeah, Sean, so Act 3, Doomsday, that's double money, so... For sure we'll be playing that at least once. Until Wednesday, of course, when that is the final day. Of that being double money. And then it'll be Diamonds in the Casino. I'm sure. Well, I'm not too sure, but yeah, I think I can predict that's what Roxel will probably do. The weekly update is good because I haven't... I don't remember the Doomsday stuff being double money in ages. Um... <laughs> what am I supposed to do? 
Yeah, Sean, I just wait until next week, because, you know, so last week it was the original heist missions. Those are double money, so this week is the Doomsday stuff, so next week surely must be the, uh, the casino stuff. Did I... did I not pick up the... Do you guys know what I'm supposed to do? What? Did I did I do something wrong? Ah, uh, hey, resident. Did I pick up the briefcase? Is it supposed to be my inventory? Uh, right, hold on. It's somewhere down here, I think. Um... Oh, that, that thing has a puncture. No, I definitely picked it up. Do you have to go back the same way I went? What did you do that for? The game glitched. Ah... Uh... Should I... Oh, I could pick up this thing. Um, is that the guy? Yeah, that's the guy that I killed. I definitely picked up the briefcase. So, so I don't, I don't know what's going on. It's glitched. How can it be glitched? <laughs> Surely Rockstar must have tested it out, or am I just like the most unluckiest person? Is so how how should I just die and restart like the whole Right I'll, hang on I'll go back to the checkpoint I'll get a wanted level and just get killed by cops and uh, then it can restart or something Look I what's Open up <laughs> Open up I have the briefcase Right that's it where, where's my chainsaw? I don't have it, okay. I'll try and blow up the car. Okay, never mind. Right, let's get the cops to me so I can... I can get killed. By someone. Yeah, take that! I'll get some money as well for that. Right, where are the cops? Uh, if you fail the mission and get the car, it's invincible forever. Oh, is that like a glitch on this game? Drive into the water. Oh yeah, I could do that. The beach is just over there. Um, uh, I'll drive around a bit, see if there's any cops. I don't think there are. What, so there's no cops? What's... There were tons and tons of them before, but now there's none. Uh, hey, peace, uh, Marlin. You love GTA so much. Yeah, this is a great game. Right, let's go for a swim. 
Oh. Oh, there we go. Mission failed. Ah, right. So it will just restart us from the last checkpoint. Do you know that if it disappears again, then I don't know what I'll do. I have to restart all over again. <laughs> oh no. Right, please, this briefcase has to... has to spawn in. It was there, I picked it up. I don't know what happened. I've got to keep an eye on it, you know. Oh my god, I, I've got to do... I, I've got to do all this again, like... Bring the guy here and... Ah. Yeah, I can hear dogs as well. That didn't happen last time, Sprinkles. What's going on? Does the game have key codes? Yeah, I think it does. We could hear that radio. Uh oh. The radio's back. Ah! I see what you mean. Yeah, so Jelly, that's why I keep having to mute the radio. Because the audio is not muted for radio things. It's not like GTA 5. Lance, but oh! Uh, Lazarus, you know, you've just reminded me that qualifying is on, isn't it, today? For the Grand Prix, Lance Stroll. Does, is that starting in like 15 minutes? Hope I can do this mission in time. You can deactivate it in settings. Does that mean I don't get the trophies for missions, though? Right. Oh yes, and good. I have my weapons. You know, I'm just saying that because there's a guy called Lance Stroll. He's like a driver in F1. Right, there's the briefcase. <laughs> right, let's hope it doesn't vanish out of nowhere. For no reason in particular. Oh, I've got, um, my body armor from last time as well. Alright, where's- get the briefcase! Get a- Oh, right, we gotta wait until those two guys on bikes turn up. And steal the briefcase. So even though you know it's gonna- they've, they're gonna steal it. It's just part of how the mission is. Maybe- maybe I should stand up here. Maybe that glitched the mission last time. Oh, look at all the money on the floor. Amazing. Right, here we go again. Right, oh. <laughs> oh, he always just gets flung off. Of the bike, right. Let's go get this briefcase. Right, so it's L1 to shoot. Whoa! Right. Did you see that, guys? I picked up the briefcase, okay? Take the briefcase. This better work. Or I'll be stuck in this mission forever. <laughs> okay. Right. What? I live. Oh, thank goodness for that. What is your name? 
Oh my, that was... Oh, okay. I thought it was glitched again for a second. Right, nice. We made, we made it. We're through. Mission pass. A million or a thousand dollars before inflation. Nice. So what mission was that? That was mission number... Number nine or attempt number nine? Right, okay. Where's the next... Okay, there's a phone. And where is the next... Mission? I think I've got a phone call. I need to answer the phone. And um, back in the day, yes, there are mobile phones, but they're like bricks and that, so... Most people just had to go to the phone booth every time. I'm going to get a call. Oh, so I... Okay, but I want to check out what this phone booth is. Why are you spoiling it? I don't think a phone call is spoiling it, is it? Well, you know, it's not like, you, like you're going to say, oh, the main character gets killed or something. Oh, that's not even... Okay, that's a different mission. <laughs> right, I thought the phone call activated when I went there. Okay, it's two different points. I need to go to this other checkpoint. Where is it? Uh... Oh. Right. There we go. Ah, uh, hey, ball cut brings back memories. Did you play this back in the day too? Because I didn't, this is... Like, this game was released today. It could have been released today, it was released yesterday. But, like, the original game, of course, was released in 2002, as Jelly told me. Because I was wondering. Right, what is this place? Uh, what's it called? Starfish Island... Starfish Island Estates. Nice. Oh, it's open! Right, this. see these gates there? Those were closed. Because I did try and, you know... <laughs> I tried to go exploring and I didn't get too far into this. Before, it, like, the game told me, Oh no, you can't go to this place or that place. Oh, there's a tornado apparently, or like a hurricane. But that's their excuse. It's like me blaming glitches whenever something goes wrong. Whenever it's my fault or something. Oh, he's watching horse racing. Okay. Who is this <laughs> Tommy Versetti. You remember me. Excuse me. I'm a little anxious. Never trust a goddamn horse. Is that a TV? You do a good job. It's a massive TV he's got. You work for me now. I work for money. As I said, amigo, you work for um, me now. Work for shut me. up. Some Judas has betrayed me. He thinks that I saw the tornado. <laughs> Well, it's, it's been a few days. No one does this to me. No one. You follow him from his apartment and you see where he goes. Later, we will kill him. Wait, who are we? I, I forgot. What did he say? We're killing somebody? Go to the thief's house and find out where he's stashing the money. This is going to be easy. Uh, where did I? Oh, yeah, there's my car. Actually, this is not my car, actually. I keep saying, oh, where's my car? It's not my car. I just steal cars. I don't think there's a way you can actually have a personal vehicle. I know there is sort of. You can save vehicles in in your garage or garage. That's about it. That's who El Rubio feeds to the panther. Wait, the guy that I just met smashed the TV. Is that the same... Is it really? Wait, is that? 
Because I, I remember that cutscene. Like when you first arrive on the islands, I think. In GTA 5, that's the same person. I need to rewatch that now. And then I'll get all the references. I just thought it was like some random guy or something. Theories, conspiracy theories or proper theories with backed up evidence. <laughs> oh, it's not. Oh, it... well, that's a cool theory though. Like if it is him or not. That's cool. I like I like those kind of things. Where's he gone? Oh. That was a weird sound effect. Too slow, Grandad. You better keep on running, asshole. This guy's got the worst aim ever. <laughs> why can't why didn't he if he wants to like kill me, he could just kill me there. Is there a bee or wasp in the room? Oh, I was so whoops. I didn't I thought you had to kill him. All right. Uh yeah, that's that's my bad. Well, they could have said Oh no, cuz they said like you need to follow the guy and see where the money is. Yeah, right. That's why I need to pay attention in the cutscenes more. It says doesn't... okay. Not to kill him. What's wrong with this car? Oh, there we go. Uh, the horn just... okay, that was weird. They just look the same. It's a different character from a different game. I'll rewatch that thing. Because you only see that cutscene once unless you rewatch it. From other people's GTA 5 online character characters and that, so yeah. Or if you rebuy the submarine, if that's even possible, or the Kosaka, same thing. Right, I'll make I'll make sure to uh, <laughs> to try and do this properly now. Right, okay. We're gonna see some cool explosions again, so like, you know I can't complain. See lots of chaos happening. And stuff like that. Right, let's go. Up the stairs. I can actually not slow walk this, but speed run this. Now that I know where to go. Um. Oh wait, um. I did all that for no reason, I'd need to... Right, never mind. Uh, hey, PM Gunner, how far did I get? So this is like mission 10 or something. There isn't a mission counter for some reason. But um, I did the chainsaw mission. Uh, the last mission was the two guys on the bikes. We had to steal a briefcase. Wait, what if I were to fall off? What happens? Not that I want to find out, of course. You better keep on running, asshole. Well, in GTA 3 yesterday, PM Gunner, I got to the 23rd mission. I'm just playing each game, like, every day. So tomorrow will be San Andreas. And then it'll be back to... back to GTA 5 online. Only that far. Yeah, I played for, like, what, 2-3 hours yesterday? And so far today, I'm roughly that way in, so is that good or bad? Like, have I made some good progress? For a first time, like a first playthrough of this game, you know, how... is that good or bad? Is there a dog in this spike? I hear a wasp or a bee and a dog going crazy at the bee and wasp. Bee or wasp. If you close your eyes, it does, it does sound like... like... 
some dogs are getting annoyed by some flying insects. And there's people shooting. The dog's got a gun! <laughs> right. Open your eyes, guys. It's just... Yeah, me on a bike with... Some guys in the back of a truck chasing me or... No, I'm, I'm the one chasing them, actually. Right, so I, I'm not allowed to kill them. I just have to follow them. Buzz... It's like my broken mic. Remember, like... It was around when the Kai Prico first came out. The Kai Prico heist. And I didn't know... That my mic was buzzing. Until... Well, yeah, PM Gunner, remember that? Like, my mic was making that weird noise. I had to reset it. Every time that happens. Sometimes. Where am I supposed to go? The original looks less cartoonish. I will kill you for this. Right, I think I'll, I'm gonna take a car, because that is just... A strange sound. Uh, this one looks much cleaner in terms of graphics. And the handling. So you guys can just see the gameplay. But I can tell you, like, the handling is great. I don't know if this picks up on the stream. Like, just driving. With my terrible driving sometimes. But yeah, it does look really good. Uh, favorite racer? That's a good question. Currently, I have to say currently first. Vettel, probably. I'd say. For the championship, I'd say the Sappen. It sounds like tryhards. Oh yeah, LZ. <laughs> oh dear, right. The handling on the original was dreadful. I can only compare GTA 3, because I had that on PS2. But even then, it was such a long time ago, I can't remember how that felt like. Oh wait, that's... Oh, that was my old checkpoint, wasn't it? Alright, let's get rid of that. Oh, the next place is over anyway, so I can just... ...drive up this way. Is that... Wait, is there a shoot shootout going on outside? Schumacher or Senna? Kind of oh, I don't know. That's that's, that's a really difficult Vol! question. Vol! I go 50-50 on that one. What, Ricardo? These idiots, they're always trying to screw you. That's the problem with this business. What do you think you're doing? These pricks have failed me miserably. Soon any mom and pop will think they could sell Gallo in Vice City. What next, huh? The stinking mafia? That gang place is a fortress at ground level. So Quentin here, Quentin, Quentin! They'll fly you over the area. Eradicate them! What We're going to be flying. You're doing? What are you doing here? Hey, I've been asking around. Uh, uh, hey, fun. You're the thinking the about joining the, the National Guard? The no, listen to me. Oh, oh right, okay. He He's beginning to trust me. Scarface Mansion. Oh, is that what this place is supposed to reference? Is the whole game meant to be a reference of that too? Oh, look at this! Whoa, okay. A qualifying started. The helicopter mission? Is that the one we got to blow up a construction building? 
Uh, oh, homing, yes, hello, homing, welcome. Is it that one, homing, that you were talking about? Yeah, I did it. I did it first try. <laughs> the controls are easier, so it's uh, a lot easier to to do that mission. Wait, was that a UFO? Oh, is that like a film studio set? Oh, it is. Okay. Oh, shoot the barrels. There we go. Take that. Are there more of them? On the lower... Oh, yep. Yeah. First try, really? Yeah, you can watch it back, homing. It was... The only problem I was having was not... Well, the controls are a bit... You know, but... They've improved the controls, so it was so easy to... So easy to play through. Qualifying, qualifying. Yeah, I'll watch it soon. It's only the first part, isn't it? Very similar to Tony Montana's mansion. And yes, there's an Easter egg of a chainsaw beside a bathtub referencing the Scarface in this game. Go to one hour in. Thank you, Jelly. Yep, so there you go, homing. One hour in, that's when I did the mission. I'm shooting everywhere apart from the tanks. There we go. And they somehow still survived. For a mission made in like 2002, this is quite... quite good. I bet your KD is higher in this game than online. Probably. I don't think they have KD ratios in this game. Was well, that only a thing added to GTA 5? Was that in GTA 4? I don't know, because I didn't really play GTA 4 too much. Or any of the other games. Like, as much as GTA 5. Collect the money on the roof. Oh! There isn't. Well, there's, there's no online, so I guess that's why. Is there another flight upstairs I can go up? Oh, yes, there is. Oh! Whoops! Oh, another briefcase. Hopefully this doesn't disappear or something. Perfect! Oh, he's gonna crash! What? Oh, that was close. And off we go. And that is the mission done. $2,000. Storm warning over. All bridges to the mainland are now open. A storm. What did I say? A tornado? It could have been a tornado. Or something. You know, the weather can change. So... How are my stats? Let me see. Mission attempts, playtime, day passed in game, four days. Find me at the boat, huh? 
Yeah, Jelly, I know. There was just a bit of background stuff. Annoying stuff going on. But anyway. Woof, woof, woof. And... Right, never mind. Okay. Woof. Right. Um... Should I do another mission? No, because qualifying starting for um, for the Grand Prix, so I, I kind of want to watch that. Tomorrow, anyway, is going to be San Andreas. That's the one everybody loves, so we'll play that. And there is a fight going on. So, yeah, I'll look at my stats again for you guys, because I showed them, but then I went mute, so. Yeah, we play through a lot. Um, yeah, so 11 missions. I think someone said there was like 83 or 87 missions, so we did a lot. And, um, how long was this stream? Like, over two hours? So, yeah. There we go. I could go back and complete this game on stream. Um, but we'll see anyway. Like, the plan is, so yesterday was GTA 3, today was Vice City, tomorrow will be San Andreas. And then... For the final day of the week on Sunday, we'll be back to GTA 5 online. So that is the plan. And, uh, right. So click Social Club. Oh yeah, these are all the trophies and stuff I think you can get on the game. Uh, but anyway. And also, this whole stream was in one part, so not once did it crash, which is great, because the stream crashed... No, the game crashed yesterday, for some reason. Right, so uh, I now have... Oh yeah, er... Oh, I should... Hang on. This can be my way for the outro. Uh, right then, so then, uh, tomorrow's stream will start roughly 4pm UK time. And I now have seven. <laughs> I now have seven thousand nine hundred twenty-two dollars. It sounds so weird. Like, to say I have so little money. My level. I don't have a level in this game, so all I can say is my money. Seven thousand nine hundred twenty-two. Is that the money? Yeah. How much money can you get? Like seven thousand. Uh, hundred thousand. I think you can get up to 99 million dollars. Considering how many zeros are there, unless the display can go up. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, so yes, I now have... 7,922 dollars, which is probably like 10 times that amount of money, probably. Uh, due to inflation, because we're in the ACs in this game. And uh, yeah, I don't have a level... whatever... Daily objectives, there are none, so never mind. So no daily bonus and stuff. Right, okay. Um, if you guys are new around here, make sure to subscribe, as this is a daily series. And turn it... Wait, did I... Wait, what did I say? Let me say that again. Right, if you guys are new around here, make sure to subscribe and turn notifications on, as this is a daily series. And also make sure to like stream if you already haven't. Um, and thank you guys for watching, thank you for commenting as well, whether we got one comment, uh, 10 comments, 100 comments, 1,000 comments, 10,000 comments, 100,000 comments, 1 million comments, 1 billion comments. Thank you guys for watching this, thank you very much. I know it's different to GTA 5, but it does have its similarities, and make sure you guys tune in tomorrow, because that is the best game out of them all. Apparently. San Andreas. GTA San Andreas, so make sure you watch that, so the stream should start around 4pm UK time tomorrow. Or I might start a little bit earlier, who knows. Uh, but anyway, let's get a nice view. What is a nice view to end the uh, thing on? I'll go to the, uh, to the water or something. I can't swim, of course. Yeah, Sprinkles, this is not GTA 5. <laughs> Oh, look at that view. Wonderful. Oh, that's brilliant. And this is set in Miami, isn't it? There's supposed to be a Grand Prix in Miami next year, actually. Which is cool. I'll be like, oh, this looks like Vice City when... You know, F1, Verstappen, Hamilton, all race around there. Orbital Cannon? Oh, no. And what's that? Presto Moxies? Our um, entering... Advice City, I think it's time uh, to wrap things up. Right then, so then, 
I think it is now time to say somebody's name. Wait, hang on. Should I, I need to save the game, don't I? Why have I not done that yet? Hold on. Where, where is the save house? Can I can I save my game? I just I nearly forgot to do that. I need to make sure the game's saved. Right, hold on, hold on. I need a car. Goodness me, imagine if I didn't save the game. All of this progress for nothing. Right. Okay, sorry about that. Um, I think there was some copyrighted music because I had everything on mute because I got interrupted. So that's brilliant. But anyway. Right. Oh, it's a CD. That's okay. Can you not save? How do you save the game? What? How am I supposed to save the game? How do you guys know how to save the game? Yes. I don't know how to save. Oh my gosh, the cassette is. <laughs> yeah, it was the cassette. Okay. Right. Saved successful. So that is saved. There we go. Oh my gosh, right. We've got a different location for the end, we've got a nice beach and stuff, so um, anyway. I have to do this by the way guys to end, so... Because I, I can't wave. Uh, protect the sugar. So once again, no daily spin. Someone knocked him out, we can't hear him. That was a comment from two, two minutes ago. Oh wait, is that Lester? I think that might be Lester. Uh, don't mind me. Oh no, it's not. Okay, maybe it looks someone like a lookalike or his brother or something. Oh, there he is again. Oh no, someone different. Right. Anyway, uh, right then. So then, I think it is now time to say somebody's name a thousand times. And on that note, thank you for watching. And until next time, it shall be tomorrow. So thank you for watching. And until next time, goodbye. Damon Hill. <laughs> Damon Hill.